Welcome back. This is your boy HT3 bringing you God in trouble. Just got the hat, y'all. <laughs> but anyways, go check out the movie Teal. It is about the Emmett Teal story. It is so powerful. It is so emotional. It is so incredible. Amazing. We all heard of the Emmett Till story. We all read in the magazine. I remember back in the uh, year 2000, I read of his story in the Jet magazine. And um, this is like the moment that the civil rights uh, movement began. Uh, the movie, it touched my heart. <laughs> if y'all go see it, make sure... Make sure you bring some napkins, paper towels, whatever with you to wipe your tears. You're going to cry during this movie, no doubt. It's about a mother's pain and the loss of a son. Um, the movie was so great. And it teaches us how prejudiced uh, things were in the South. That the movie... Started, I think, in 1955, and everything went all downhill in Money, Mississippi. And um, the movie is going to touch you about this woman, her passion, Emma Till's mother. Um, her passion, her drive to find out what happened to her son. And she knew that justice would not be served but she had to continue to fight for black rights <laughs> like i say y'all go check out the movie i know if y'all probably read it in the book i heard about it throughout the years ain't nothing like seeing the actual movie to me was a very powerful scene when they brought Emmett Till's body to his mother. She loved her son and she embraced him in that bad condition that he was in. She wanted the world to see, look what hatred, look what being racist, Look what the devil did to her son. And also, his mother was a strong Christian woman who had faith in God. The movie showed her praying, calling out to God, saying, God, please have mercy on me. Powerful. It showed you, um, no matter how dark things get in life, we all still have to pray and worship God no matter what happens. And uh, I feel like even though it was a, a moment in black history, I feel like the world can get something from it too. Um, no matter what's your race, no matter what color you are, if something like this was dead to your son or daughter, the pain is still the same. The pain is still the same, no matter what color you are. You can identify with this black mother pain, no matter what color you are, no matter how, how old you are. And I hope all color of people come check this movie out. To understand the future, we must go back to the past. And all of the actors and actresses, they played their role. The movie showed how Emmett Till, he wasn't from the South. He was not. He was a city boy. And... His mother was telling him, don't do certain things while you're down there. They wanted him to um, 
Go see where he go see where he come from. Go learn hard work. Spend time with your family in the south. But in Matil, he didn't listen. He played games with this white woman at the store. He was just uh, goofing out, playing around. He did not deserve to be brutally murdered. He did not deserve. He did not deserve it at all. Man, I was in a theater with two older white women. Once they captured Emmett Till in this movie, one white lady walked out the theater. She walked out. She could not see. She did she not want to see what they were going to do to this little boy. But the movie really didn't get all graphic during the beating. But we know what really happened. And what shocked me in this movie, what shocked me to learn that some black people had a hand in kidnapping this little boy. Some black people helped with this. Well, in a way, go check out this powerful movie. 10 out of 10. It's a great black movie. But it's a movie that the world can see and be proud of. Because I believe we have come a long way from that day. Peace out. This is your boy HT3 bringing you God and Travel.